welcome back to my channel as you guys have seen by the title of today's video today I am bringing you all my Christmas wish list for 2021 because I, as I am filming this we are currently on the 2nd of December which means there are only 23 days until Christmas like how exciting like Christmas is really coming very soon and I am hoping I am praying fingers crossed it will not be in a lockdown for Christmas because imagine if we were in a lockdown for Christmas but that means we'd all be trapped in our homes pretty much and it's like it it would be depressing I'm going to be doing in my wishes video because the Christmas is coming up and I don't have too much on in my wish list because it was just my birthday but I am excited to kind of share with you if what is on my wish list maybe you can put it on your list if you, if you like as well but before we get into this video please make sure to leave a thumbs up comment down below also subscribe and without further ado let's get on with the video just before i tell you what is on my wish list if you guys are struggling of what to put on your christmas list this year or need any ideas to buy your friends and family please stay and watch this part of the video because this is the best part of the video i am not even lying to you guys i am super excited because the lovely brand rep tinny has actually gifted me one of their most gorgeous chanel handbags i mean just look at the gift bag for a start like wow look at that chanel okay so i know a lot of my subscribers and followers are big fans of the designer tubes and the real designer items everything designer a lot of you guys are subscribed to me because of that reason because of my dhk and vova hauls so please stay and watch this part of the video because i do have an absolute beauty here and i'm gonna unbox it for you guys because you guys love the designer bits as i've already said and i don't actually have a chanel handbag myself so a bit of background about Repetini basically they are a brand that sells designer replicas or sell handbags watches belts clothes shoes anything you like they will sell on there and their customer service is absolutely amazing the lovely lady Julia who actually runs the business actually got in touch with me and said I've watched your DHK hauls and I would love to work with you on a video and of course I had to accept it because her design items, can I just say, they are A class. So I will put a photo of, of her Instagram here, but let's do the unboxing because I, I'm pretty sure you guys are really excited. So the box is so luxurious. It's such good quality. There's no dints or marks on the box at all. It's really good. Right, I'm just gonna move further back. Then here is the dust bag. It actually says Chanel. Look at that. Look how nice this bag is guys it's absolutely stunning then i'm just gonna you know open it up i am obsessed with this bag so basically they have actually sent me this absolutely stunning i'm honestly amazed by it a chanel boy bag it's basically called the cl a boy bag on the website it is a lovely green color you know, have this in a lot of the different colors and everything like that and it's the mini version as well so it's not too big it's perfect size for taking it out with you can put all of your bits and bobs in there and also it look it opens really cool look at this open it up it's absolutely stunning it's made out of real leather real leather guys honestly amazing and it also comes with an authentication card as well authentication authenticity card i've kept it in the packaging but there it is it says the chanel and it says it all in french so well, that's pretty cool the bag itself is well built the stitching is in place the color as well is absolutely stunning the gold chain is so heavy because i have had a lot of designer tubes in the past and the chains on a lot of handbags have been really cheap quality but this chain is super heavy which is obviously a good thing because as a lot of you guys may know the real Chanel handbags are a lot of money so they're also going to be very heavy chains and then inside it just says Chanel and it actually has a date code and stuff which is really cool I do also have a discount code for you guys it is 
in capitals, all in capitals, Alice H. And in December, you can actually get 15% off with my code instead of 10%. So this is the perfect time to grab a bargain. This beautiful handbag it usually retails for £276. However, with my discount, it'll actually be £234. So it's worth getting it whilst it's December and you get extra 5% on top of the 10%, you know, you're saving a bit of money. Obviously, they are more pricier compared to Fova and DH Kit, but trust me guys, you are paying for the quality. You get a lovely bag with it, you get the box as well, as you can see. It's such good quality, look, if you open it up, it's like a magnet. You open it up and then you want to close it. It's so satisfying and yeah, the bag is just a triple A quality, which is what you need in a designer tube. I love this so much. Thank you very much, Reptini, for sending me over this gorgeous handbag. I will leave all of their details in the description of this video, so please make sure to visit the website and don't forget to use my discount code because it is worth using miles. In December, in the Christmas time, they will make amazing presents, and I am going to be getting a lot of use and. If I was ever stuck for ideas, I would actually think of getting a designer handbag or something or or even a cheap look at like this gorgeous one itself. So thanks again. I will definitely be using this handbag and also please make sure to click the website and the links in the description. But yeah, now I'm gonna move on to my a wish list which I am I am very excited to kind of show you guys. We love a bit of sun glaring in my face, so I apologise if the sun is gonna uh, probably make my face look like a ghost. But first item I am actually gonna start off with that I've actually put on my wish list is the way I sell the Libra perfume. I already have it at the moment, but it's that type of perfume you can wear all the time and you'll never get bored of it. I actually got this in Lanzarote two years ago now and it has it lasted me very well for two years so I'm obviously wanting to get a new one so that I won't run out of it because th this smell it, if I had to describe it it reminds me of when you're getting ready in the hotel room on holiday and like you spray your perfume and stuff like I think because I bought it in Lanzarote it just it brings me back to the sun and holiday and dressing up but it is a very dressy up scent however I wear this all the time because it just smells unreal and it's a very grown up scent but it's honestly amazing. The packaging is beautiful and I could never be without this perfume so if, if you may be thinking of putting this on your wishes as well or you've heard of it and you've never tried the other way I sell perfume I recommend you do because it is my ultimate favourite perfume. It's a very strong smelling scent but it's absolutely amazing as I said and I've had a lot of compliments on it, so it's definitely something I, I will never be able to live without with now. Scott, if you're watching this and you haven't bought it yet, this is your your chance to, you know, it's a really nice perfume. So yeah, that is the first thing I've asked for, and I am pretty sure I'm going to be getting it because it's un like it's unreal, literally. The next item is that I've asked for is makeup brushes because I am a makeup artist, if you don't know, and. I do use makeup a lot on myself and my clients, but a lot of my makeup brushes that I use on myself are getting old. Some of the handles have actually fallen off. Like whatever the makeup bits I have or brushes, I always have the old stuff and use the new stuff like on my clients. So I'm basically left with or not the rubbish stuff, but the kind of older bits and bobs. So you know when. The mothers they buy you know, the children like the nicer clothes and then the mum will just have like the basic clothes on. Yeah, that is like me with makeup brushes and makeup. They're, like I'll be using you know, the really old the makeup on myself and using like all the up to date stuff on my clients. Does that make any sense? But anyway, I'm gonna stop talking about that. But yeah, so basically I am in need of, of some makeup brushes because as I said the handles are breaking off, the bristles are coming off. Yeah, it, it's good to get a few new makeup brushes every year for Christmas. So, this is now my chance to ask for some. So, the brands 
I like makeup brushes at Spectrum. I also love the Peaches and Cream and Doll Beauty ones as well. Um, and Morphe brushes are fairly good as well and Real Techniques. So I do have a lot of options there. I feel as if I'm quite an easy person to buy for and I'll be happy with any type of makeup brushes as long as the wear the brands I've just mentioned because those brands of brushes are insane and for myself I use a lot of Real Techniques and Spectrum and I use the Peaches and Cream ones as well. So yeah, they're really good brands. The Peaches and Cream also have a lot of deals on their brushes and they're really good quality and Spectrum are really... Spectrum are more pricier but insane quality again. And Real Techniques is like in between I'd say but the quality is still there so the makeup brushes is a must because it isn't it really something I buy myself so it's definitely something good to put on your wish list. The next thing is stone coloured pants. If you don't know what a stone colour is I'll insert a photo here. It's basically like a creamy nude colour and I've got a jacket in that colour and I absolutely love it. I wear it all the time and I've been wanting some stony coloured pants for ages and I've tried them on in Primark and they were horrendous. I've tried them on in other shops and I went into River Island they didn't have any left and I just had no luck because I've been wanting to kind of change up what I wear on my bottom half because I'm, I'm always wearing black pants and jeans. I wanted to ask for something that I wouldn't be able to buy myself so I know that I am getting some stony coloured pants because my mum actually ordered me some and I had to try them on. So I think I'm actually getting a misguided pair and they fit me really nicely so I am excited to open them on Christmas day. They're a really nice colour and they will look even better with a tan. Yeah I'm I'm really excited. I'm such like an old lady now but like I get excited over clothes and stuff like it's a bit um embarrassing sometimes. I have actually also asked for a new bronzer because I did get a bronzer for my birthday a couple of years ago and it's hit pan I'm in need of a new one so I've actually asked for either a NARS bronzer or really dull beauty ones because if we actually now have a NARS canter in the boots in Carlisle which I'm excited about um, and I've had a look at the bronzer and it looks unreal it's obviously £30 it's a lot of money for a bronzer however the dull beauty ones are around £15-£20 and it's like in the shape of a love heart and the doll beauty makeup is absolutely unreal so I have asked for a bronzer because I'm always in need of makeup and I like it when people buy me more expensive makeup because like it doesn't mean I have to buy it myself um, so it's a good way of getting expensive makeup pretty much but yeah the bronzers are really expensive though so that's why I have put it on my Christmas list. Next up is slippers because as you can probably tell I need some new slippers and I get them every year for Christmas, it's a basic present but I'm always in need of slippers and I cannot live without them because in the winter times especially they keep your feet so warm so of course I need some slippers and I think Scott is maybe getting me slippers but yeah I am in desperate need of slippers um, and that it goes you know, the same with dressing gowns as well. I always ask for a new dressing gown every year for Christmas. I mean, the one I have at the moment, I've got a pretty little thing one and it's in good condition. It's nice getting a fresh new dressing gown. It's like all fluffy, it's never been in the wash, it's all clean, you know, and the same with dressing gowns. I wear them all the time. I wear them all day, every day pretty much. It's just so comfortable and just a staple in my life right now, literally. <laughs> And next up I have actually asked for lush stuff so I've not asked for anything in particular apart from the Snow Fairy shower gel. That scent it will always have a special place in my heart. Oh my god it smells unreal and I think they've actually brought out a Snow Fairy candle so it would be nice to get that maybe but I don't, I've not really asked for that but I feel as if if, if anybody it was going to be buying me a Snow Fairy candle, it would be Scott because he's always up to date with what's in Lush and stuff because he loves Lush himself but I've not really asked for anything in particular really I like the bubble bars as well but we'll have to wait and see you know next up is eyelashes because I love my lashes as you can tell I do have some really big fluffy ones on as well and the tie lashes and Dolby are my faves so I'm definitely going to be 
they will hopefully get in some more because eyelashes again are expensive things to get and I wear them all the time so of course it's like a thing I'm going to put on my list because you can never have too many lashes you know I've actually also put a blanket on my wish list the Scottish actually here right now and I've actually been hinting at him for like a, a blanket because in home bargains and other shops and stuff they've got this kind of like it's like a teddy bear material and it's pink and oh my god I love my blankets I actually have a lovely one on my bed at the moment it is quite old but oh my god they keep you so warm and it, it, it's a perfect present to receive at Christmas time because it obviously is really cold and stuff so <laughs> someone's going to be disappointed <laughs> <laughs> well I'm, I'm hinting at you but anyway yeah so a blanket is something I love I always need them and the same with eyelashes you can never have too many of them so you know you can <laughs> <laughs> next I have actually put the jeans on my wish list I don't know if I've actually asked for them off my mum I did kind of mention to her but I don't know if I've actually told her really but with jeans I feel as if the cheap ones the Primark always stretch in the wash and I love the Levi jeans however they're really expensive and I do have a pair of Levi's and oh my god the quality is so much better the Zara jeans are really good as well but the Levi's is just like another level of quality so I do really need a new pair of jeans it may be like a darker colour because I usually have a mid kind of wash if I don't get them I can probably buy them in in the Boxing Day sales you'll be doing plenty of shopping in, in the Boxing Day sales you know what I mean it's got a like with our Christmas shopping and stuff and just shopping in general we're just shopaholics I think do you agree? Yep. yep it does he agrees the next up I have actually well Scott actually it was telling me about this actually so you want to come along or not? I'm alright no well basically he asked me if I would like a diffuser and I thought he meant a reed diffuser and I was thinking no but he kind of told me and I was like oh my god of course I do it's basically like a diffuser where you put the water in it and then like you put the scented oils in and it's it basically vapors out and Scott actually has one himself and it's really nice and relaxing and there's quite a few in TK Maxx and in home bargains and stuff and they look really cool and it's something I would never thought of putting on my Christmas list however Scott is full of good ideas for presents and stuff he's always very he always thinks of a very unique but really cool presents yeah he's nodding his head because he knows that's very true so yeah so I'm going to put in like a diffuser on my list and hopefully Scott is maybe going to get me one who knows but, but yeah that is something that's maybe going to be on my list I hope or maybe he might be under the tree <laughs> <laughs> your face <though. laughs> sorry I should be and the final present on my wish list yeah, to be honest yeah, the wish list isn't too big because it has just been my birthday so everything I've asked for my birthday I pretty much received but yeah, the final thing is another old poly set I know I got one for my birthday but I actually tried on a red one and oh my god it is unreal so I'm I'm hoping I'll be getting a red old poly set for Christmas because it's like a gym a kind of a company but I don't go to the gym but oh my god the their sets are so comfortable so I've asked for the red one I think it's part of the Megan Grubb the collaboration again but oh my god the quality is always insane so I think I might be getting it because I've already tried it on again but I'm excited to get it if I do get it obviously but yeah the bone tea sets are the best things to receive at Christmas time as well but anyway guys here is the end of my wish list video please make sure to click the links in the description and make sure to visit the Reptony Instagram and their website as well because you need to get your hands on all of their designer pieces especially their Chanel handbags they are just another level of I don't even know like the quality like it's made out of real leather it looks so cute they have all sorts of brands 
They're like Chanel, a Louis Vuitton, they've got a Gucci as well. A lot of a variation and you can definitely trust the the company because all of their products are arriving from 15 days as well which I think is super fast they're coming from China and stuff but yes you definitely check them out because I I will actually be making an order from them now 100% it's way better than DHgate so if you're thinking of maybe making an order on DHgate think twice <laughs> but yes if you guys have enjoyed this video please make sure to leave a thumbs up a comment down below also subscribe and i will see you all in my next video bye everybody